Polestar 1 hybrid to arrive in 2019 on a subscription service, but the UK market will have to make do with left-hand drive. No longer a sub-brand of Volvo, Polestar plans to put its first standalone model, the Polestar 1, into production in 2019. It'll be built at a new facility in China, and while it will be available in the UK and other markets worldwide, it will only come in left-hand drive. It's expected to be priced from around €130,000 £115, in Europe. Along with the production-ready coupe, Polestar has two further, all-electric products in the pipeline, a saloon to rival the Tesla Model 3, and a larger SUV. They'll be named Polestar 2 and Polestar 3, respectively. The Polestar 1 is being touted as an electric performance hybrid, and will make use of a 338bhp 2.0-liter 4-cylinder petrol engine sending drive to the front wheels. A starter motor generator will inject a further 39bhp, and electric motors will send 215bhp to the rear axle. That means total power reaches 592bhp, with torque hitting 1000Nm. The Polestar 1 will be capable of 0 to 60 miles per hour in under 4 seconds. Polestar claims that the car can run on the rear electric motor and integrated starter motor only, and this provides a claimed all-electric range of 93 miles. As well as the high-performance hybrid powertrain, the Swedish firm has kitted out the Polestar 1 with driver-configurable active suspension from specialist Tollens. Polestar claims the system can react to changes in the road surface in less than 2 milliseconds. Large brakes with six-piston calipers from Akibono provide stopping power, while the planetary gearbox driving the rear axle doubles as a torque vectoring unit. The Polestar 1 takes the design language of the S90 saloon and morphs it into a smooth 2 plus 2 coupe format. But at 4,500mm in length, it's shorter than the S90, and also has a 320mm shorter wheelbase than the saloon.